Before I start, I wanted to uh, let you know that at approximately 10.30 this morning uh, in the Oval Office, the President was notified by his Homeland Security Advisor, John Brennan, uh, of the shooting in Newtown, Connecticut at a school. The President is receiving regular updates as more information becomes available about this incident. Uh, and uh, as the day proceeds, if we get more information and as we get more information, we'll certainly provide it to you. I do not have uh, uh, anything to confirm for you at this point. Uh, the FBI is uh, supporting state law enforcement, which has the lead, as well as local law enforcement, as they respond to and begin to investigate this incident. Uh, and as I said, the President will receive regular updates as the day progresses. I'll take your questions. Okay, one follow on that. Can you relate to us any of the President's reactions or thoughts? Obviously, these shootings are all, all of them are tragic. We're hearing some particularly heinous numbers. Uh, and the fact that children were involved. Uh, I would rather not relay uh, reactions at this point because I don't have any confirmation to give to you uh, about what exactly has happened there or uh, potential victims. So at this point, I'd rather just uh, inform you that the President has been uh, informed about the shooting, was informed at 1030, and is being given regular updates as more information becomes available. Uh, given that the President's not running for re-election, uh, and he previously... Barring a change in the Constitution. Right. And he previously made a campaign promise to oppose... And previously made a campaign promise to work to renew the assault weapons ban. Why won't you stand up here today and say that that remains a commitment of his? It does remain a commitment of his. What I said is that today is not the day to, in, I believe, uh, as a father, a day to engage in the usual Washington policy debates. I think that that day you know, will come, uh, but today is not that day, especially as we are awaiting more information for the, about the situation in Connecticut. Uh, Jay, earlier this week, the uh, Seventh Circuit uh, overturned Illinois' the President's home state's law uh, forbidding concealed carry. Uh, does the President agree with that decision? Do you think, uh, does he think the court decided correctly? One. And two, uh, earlier you suggested that today is not the correct day to debate gun control laws. Um, but given that this is the second uh, considerable incident this week after the one in Oregon, when would be a good time to have that debate? I've stated repeatedly what the President's position uh, is on uh, legislation that uh, uh, Ms. Yellen mentioned and, and, uh, and more broadly. Uh, my, my point is that as this incident is unfolding in Connecticut, uh, you know, our, our, our minds and our focus need to be on what's happening there and providing uh, assistance uh, where we can uh, to those who need it in Connecticut. 